Good everyone, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back for another video in Revolution 2. P.S. My video, I accidentally did my video again. I do this every time. I do not know why, but wait a minute, we're back in Red Dead 2. Oh, I just got his old hair back. Do I need more pomade? No, I don't do I have to buy more pomade. But in this video, we're gonna go off to Rhodes. Um, Rhodes or Santini, like, yeah, I, I, I'll go find a fast travel post. How far is that there? If you didn't know, I lost my freaking hunting, my legendary bear. I'm really pissed about it. Honestly, I'm really pissed about it. Because I was going to sell it, but... I got the Morgan still, the decent horse. Um, and then a couple of years ago, we got the legendary horse. Uh, the legendary... Rabin? Rabin? Rabin. Rabin? I can't pronounce it right. I apologize, but... What the hell is this? Hello sir, I am after me. How you doing? I'm doing well dude, what's up? Okay there. The fire's warm. You're welcome to share it with me. Sure. I need some fire anyway, I've been like, you know, I you trust to... me then? Hmm, I do. Sometimes we must trust each other, even when we don't know each other, or else we walk this life alone. What do you do? Well, I know animals? you're a thief and a killer, but I rely on my instincts to tell me otherwise. Oh, really? Yes, I see in your eyes that you're not a bad man. Hey. Like I was riding through the heartlands the other day, and caught through someone's land. It looked like an old pig farm. When a couple called me over from the house, very nice man and woman. Very friendly. You would think this is fine, you know? And they keep saying that a traveler like me deserves some rest and refreshment, inviting me to stay for dinner. I was tired and I was hungry, but mi corazonada, the feeling in my gut said no. I don't know why, but I trusted it. Well, now. Then the very next day, a man warns me to stay away from that place. So I live by my instincts. I'm also real fast with a gun, which helps me when the instincts fail me. Mm. Well, I've sat long enough. You rest here as long as you need. What? Uh, really? Okay, see you later. I uh, can you camp? <laughs> what the? <laughs> stuff What kind of bracket is it? We can skin it. Oh, we need that anyway. Now what else we got here? So this guy was hunting stuff. Yeah, that's all he really has. It's pretty useless, but I gotta go um Yep. I don't know. Got some skins for uh, Pearson. Yeah, I'm for new bags and everything we can do that, like I guess about red dead is the hunt and everything, but I don't need deers. 
I need an elk. If I remember, I need a lot of stuff. A buck. Two. Like, a lot of stuff I need, but... I'm gonna go off the roads, because I got something to sell, about 500, but I think it's like, it's only a few gold bars or not, as I did the treasure thing, which I record in part. I have it on my YouTube channel, my, my other videos I had. Doesn't really matter, but, yeah, I've got some treasure. It's great, and positive. Oh, I got the roads. How far is that? Five dollars. Anyway, I'm gonna sell it anyway. But it's good. Good money. Good stuff. Um good stuff. Yeah, my mafia free for me uh copyright the other day, I couldn't believe it. Because they're scumbags like kind of like this shit is so annoying. <laughs> so annoying. But um, we got this back of roads. Follows me. Let's go, girl. That's a girl. Yeah. Girl Morgan. <laughs> Morgan. No, in truth, this man deserves no earthly respect from us. As a sign of respect to our Creator, we pay respect to the dead. Oh, Father, what do we say about a man who lost his way so awfully? He carried that awful war with him, rustling horses with a misguided gang of killers. A brave man, undone by pride, doomed to a life of sin and vice. That guy killed? Let us pray for this man. Yes. Father, provide him mercy. That's him. Amen. Amen for sure. Rip. Those were kind words, Father. Maybe. But what good are words? It feels strange when people die, like, why are they dying? Like, I think... I have very fascinations about life and... You see death and everything. Oh, it's just so fascinating. Just get out of my way. Drink, alcoholic. Well, long time no see, stranger. Hey man, I got some... Gold rock, I got. I got this. Thank you, a thousand dollars. Oh yeah. Got some coffee. I got some clamps. Been a minute. Thousand dollars. Got anything good for me by any chance? Ooh. Okay, girl. Yeah, nah, I need to buy some poor maid. Get more money like this, we'll save money up and we'll do this. a great card for challenge. Morning, sir. Hey, mister. Will you give me some money? Yeah, it's a dollar. Sure. Thank you. Say, say, where you from? Around. <laughs> Ain't from around here. Yeah, it was you I'd leave. This town lost its goddamn soul a long time ago. <laughs> Nothing but nasty, miserable people. Yeah? Yeah, ever since them, them greys moved here. They're a bunch of no-good white trash. Yeah, they, they somehow got rich. About 50 years ago, they moved here, caused a whole heap of trouble. Yeah, I reckon they was... Looking they was Yankee spies during the war and everything. That's so. Yeah, sure.
Mister. Morning, Mister. Morning, Master. First time here, I think. Uh, candy's in the middle there, next to the cute little dollies, and must love to my self-respect. I have a catalog too, up here. Oh, uh, okay, sorry. I just assumed you couldn't read. What? Don't don't offend me, mate. You don't want this place getting robbed. I'll buy that. I need some poor mate. Buy two of them. Thanks. Thanks. That should be good. Thanks. I'm gonna take my jacket Goodbye. off. Looks so nice. I give half the money into Dutch in the game, five hundred. There's nothing really can get, but let's get back to home. Five hundred dollars I got. Half of the money. I gave them six hundred. Five grand is good. Howdy, mister. You want dark pay? Get back to work. Howdy. I thought I recognized you. Hello again. Hello, Elden. Here you go. Elder. Uh, Aiden, sorry. You do it back in the day. How you do, buddies? Hmm, what are we doing today? What are we doing today in Red Dead? We got the legendary we're gonna do. Too much for that. We'll do that in the next couple of videos. We've got a lot of stuff we're doing. Yes, yes, we'll do that later. We'll do a lot of stuff. Yeah. I might buy some stuff because I'll get 500 of them. Okay, I'm a nice guy. It's all that gold is theirs. Yes. <laughs> 
Hope you had a good old time. Craft term, do you know that? I've played this game so many times. <laughs> Give me. Well done, Arthur. You found the Irish Terrier. Sadly, he's just a younger version of you. Please don't say that to me, Dutch. <laughs> oh, it's true. <laughs> it's true. Really? You're obnoxious like Sean? How embarrassing are you? You alright there? Alright for some. Oh, so he looks dried up. Right there. Five hundred dollars, okay. Hey, farther! What you want? Only when I see you. What do you want? Only when I see you. Don't annoy me, Uncle. Fucking Jesus. I don't want to hear your fucking annoying voice, you Lebago. That's your excuse. dollars let's look at the ledger we got stuff to buy I want to camp I want off it's get a fast travel that's what I want put something warm on would you dude is like 20 or 19 degrees in this game why would I do it Molly tell me tell me Molly why should I do it yes that's what I want Good morning, Arthur. Good morning, Strauss. Is that food gonna be ready soon? It's coming, it's coming. We get more medication. Enough buying. <laughs> Who's that? Look at that. More food for boys. Ah, perfect. A minute and two minutes and a half looking at stuff, but we got my table awaits your offerings, Mr. Morgan. Yeah, I hear you. Good job, Mr. Morgan. Arthur, don't forget, I'm more than happy to craft you something if you bring me the right materials. Oh, that's upgraded, okay. Okay. Oh. We do all that, we're done. Appreciate it, Pearson. Okay, what are we doing? We've done all the main missions, really. Main mission we got Kieran. But I want to do a little mission with oh, yeah. heavier, heavier Escobeda. So you brought the loudmouth kid back to us. I'm sorry. I wanted them to hang him. <laughs> well, he amuses me. You done good, Arthur. Loyalty. 
Room here by the fire if you want. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I'm worried. You busy, Arthur? Good morning, Arthur. You seem better? Yeah, almost feel normal again. You were never normal, Marston. Yeah. What do you want, buddy? Javier? I heard about a house. Could be interesting. What kind of a house? I don't know. A couple fellas I heard in town, they said... said it was really... freakish. A family local boogeyman, I guess. But they're crooked in every way. So? Well, so these boys thought they were sitting on a lot of cash. They're highway robbers, kidnappers, apparently. They're well hidden in the woods. That sounds pretty dubious. Of course, uh, yeah, it's dubious, but there ain't much risk of getting caught. Okay, then. Let's go. Let's go take a look. Exactly. Just take a look. Take a look. On the other side of the river from Valentine. Best way there is through Cumberland Falls, though. You know it? Sure, more or less. Yeah, I think that's nice. Hmm, let's go. Why are you on it? Because it's like a flam. Yeah! <laughs> Shotgun in. Yeah. No pump shotgun. Use this. Yeah, we got this. Oh! Okay, we're pretty close now. Let's stop and go on foot from here. There's a spot up ahead where we should be able to get a good look at the place. I want to make sure we don't run into any surprises. Sure. Apparently. This family's been isolated for so long, they started talking in their own weird dialect. They really don't like outsiders, especially on their turf. <sighs> well, you just keep selling me on this job, don't you? Jesus. Well, big place, right? Do I have it, have you? Let me a look. Well, there's a pretty big barn in the back. It's not a bad place to start looking. There must be a lot of people living here. A large house. This desk could be in any one of them buildings, and who knows how many people are in there. <clears throat> I ain't sure about this. Boy, I, I think we need to draw them out somehow. And I got an idea. Follow me. these trees I can't get a proper look at the place well hopefully it'll make it harder for them to spot us too the coast seems clear so far yeah so far hey keep it down I hear voices Come on, let's hide behind this shed. See if we can hear what they're saying. Just stay quiet. 
Reapers, Finn. Don't score notions in the Diffy Flemings' head. Where you been now, Newt? Don't be boiling now, Pappy. I has gone but ten minutes I was. You can only gag all the now day long, cause Edie takes patrol now, don't you? What? No, Edie, get all the jam! You shut your gulper, or I'll flag her your felt, I will. Jesus. You should pull it up, boy. Up the cell. Go guard the shed. Go! You understand what they're saying? Not much of it. What are we doing out here? Okay. You take cover by the rock over there. I'll create a little distraction. Then you jump them, okay? What kind of distraction? Kind of distraction will benefit for us. That's what Arthur. Check in there first. Why is that Red Dead One theme not on the soundtrack? No. Oh, great. That's useful for hunting. Has to be under here. There's no place else that can store it. Okay. Give me a hand here. Wait, I'm looking still. Jesus. Crackers. We need to find the money and get the hell out of here. Um, have you yet? Calm the fuck down. Right there. That's not Siggy. Okay. 
can get more cards with this. Sometimes there's nice stuff here. See? What's this? I wonder. It's a pump shotgun. I already got one. Two shotguns. Chest. What's in here? Gun and run. How interesting. Pretty freaking useless, honestly, but yeah, cool. Okay, I want to leave these bodies first. I don't have shit here anymore. Down. Another chest. Ha ha ha. Funny. Box. We <gasps> got Dutch and I uh, well, got a color red, but look at that fifty dollars. Coffee's coughing. Ah, well, look what we have here. I told you it was worth the trouble, didn't I? Yeah, you take this. Let's split up. I'll meet you back at camp. Right, sounds good. <coughs> Alpha, stop coughing. <laughs> oh my god, are we getting sick already? No, I made like three hundred dollars. Basically, I made two hundred dollars. Was there any horses here? I saw a horse here. What's this? I think I already have a map in pain. Okay. Oh, this is fine. We have a map in pain, but. Yep. Good money. Then we can 
fast travel back to camp easily yeah, now. We don't have to do cuts on my channel now. <laughs> okay. Let's go. Like, oh no. Overlook. Okay, there's a new one. Let's get this. What's the time? It is 6 o'clock. We don't have any food for ages in this game. Well, you got a fever or something? I, it's too cold to dress like that. Dude, it's. Oh, yeah, kind of true. Hello, Arthur. You'll work it out, Dutch. You always do. Anything I need to worry about? Not right this minute. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Thank you. Don't worry about it, Reverend. I made a fool of myself again. We've all done that, Reverend. I'm bitterly ashamed. Really, I am. The preacher, I remember. Soon. Now, I want to give this fifty dollars because I them fifty bucks because I got fifty dollars. It's fair, and share. All right, Martin. All okay, Mr. Esquin? John. Strauss. That's my boy. You know, I'm so nice. I gave the camp some money. So if you do, it's a, it's a cut. Some nice stuff. And we got this. This is my stuff I need. Three million dollars we have left. Decent. Hi there, Arthur. Hey, what's up? Any goodies we need? Oh my god, we gotta read this. Mr. Morgan, bring me some materials, and I'll be glad to make something nice for you. Okay, elk, panther, bison, raccoon, okay. Beaver, pelt. Craft free represents at the sky fire. Uncle? Well, I reckon I'm gonna think about it. I'll stream some Red Dead. <laughs> okay. Let's get to sleep. Let's go the next day. And we'll get ready.
Good morning. Okay. Got a special mission. Morning, Arthur. There's a coffee. some speaking to do of your own not that old gang of yours I said I told you I don't know nothing that's what I thought whoa hold your horses there it seems the uh, cat has got our friend here's tongue I was thinking mr. Williamson could have a word you ready to talk boy I told you mister I told all of you I don't know nothing okay they ain't no friends of mine I just been ridden with them for a Horse while. Horseshit! You see, we heard that part, so how about you tell the truth? That's what you want me to do. Hurt him, so the next time he opens his mouth, it is to tell us what is going on! Ah! Uh, who am I kidding? One of O'Driscoll's boys couldn't open his mouth, but he'd tell a lie. Screw it. Let's just have some fun. Huh? Geld him. Yeah! What's he doing? Where's he going? Oh, don't worry. You're only balls, boy. It's gonna cause you trouble. <laughs> you know, in Imperial Rome, Unix was among the happiest and most loyal of courtiers. Oh, no, you're kidding me, right? Of course. You sick bastards! Oh, what do you want from me? Well, you are gonna talk. The only question is now or after we got these little fellas off. Okay, okay, listen. I know where old Driscoll was holed up, and you're right. He don't like you any more than you like him. He's at Six Point Cabin. Uh, I'll take you there. Serious, I don't like him. I mean, I like him even less than I like you. No offense. Oh, none taken. Okay, then, partner. Uh, uh, Why don't you take a few of us up there right now? I got this, Dutch. Should be fun. All right, you. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Let's both hope you ain't trying to trick us, O'Driscoll. I ain't no O'Driscoll. Well, you sure as shit was. John, Phil, come here. We got a social call needs making. Where are we heading? Uh, we're up into the hills behind Valentine. Uh, well, I'll show you. John, you take this little rattlesnake with you. And that nonsense, kill him. Sure. You're gonna pay your buddies our respects. He taking us to Cole? That's what he says. Come on. I'm taking you to him. Look, I I'll give you more directions when we're close. But if I know where we are, it's up past Valentine. Let's go. All right, I'll lead. Sharing saddle with an old Driscoll. Who'd have thought? How many times I gotta say? I ain't an old Driscoll. You sure look like one, and you smell like. God damn. You smell like one, too. I smell like horse shit. That's right. Boy, are you high. <laughs> okay, well, for now, this, you know, good old. Yep. Morgan! You got throwing knives in your saddlebag. Doug said that you might. I was asked to give them, and I'm doing you the further courtesy of telling you about it. Next time you want to give me something, how about you give it to me, instead of hiding it somewhere, hoping the opportunity comes up to mention it. Last goddamn favor I do you. Hey, hey, if, if I got my bearings, it's over here. Yeah, I know this country. Take this track up through the rocks. Williamson, Williamson. What, Morgan? Just to say, well, even you can't screw up killing O'Driscoll's. Funny. And I guess you're good here. 
Unless some soft-handed feller comes along and tells you you've gone too far. What are you talking about? Fighting that big bullet up in Valentine? How wise you think beating a man to death would have been? With all them folks looking on, when we supposed to be laying low. I saw your eyes, Morgan. You didn't go clever, you went soft. Uh, I'll take it. After all, you are an authority on not being clever. The captive gets a little cough in his throat, looks at you with some big doe eyes. You gonna let Comb go free? Oh, no. I was fighting Comb when you was pretending to fight Indians. Don't call my record into question. It's your abilities that call your record Watch out. into question, Bill. Now we go left, the uh, road will take us up and round. different from the old Driscoll's. What did you just say? I've been watching you all these weeks, and, uh... You've been tied to a tree. You don't know nothing about this gang. Yeah, well, I'd, I'd say you don't know much about the old Driscoll's. But maybe I know more about you than you know about them. And I know all about them, so... <laughs> Tell us then. How are we like those mongrel dogs? You're outlawed like them. You're out to survive like them. You live rough. You live hard. Of course. Fighting the law. Nature. You're out for yourselves. See? This is why you're an O'Driscoll, O'Driscoll. You're out to survive. We're out to live. Free. Colm's a sneak thief and a killer. Dutch is... Dutch is more like a teacher. From where I've been, you just look the same as all. Then you looked, but you ain't seen. John! Shut that boy up. Enough out of you. Boss, we're almost on them. Now, who knows if this son of a bitch we got with us is talking true, yeah, but see. if it's what he says it is, and Colm O'Driscoll's here, we can end years of fighting. Here and now. Amen to that. Here, here. I swear, this is where he was. Shut up. Okay, now, now cut left up here. We, we go down the hill into the forest. Yeah, this place. We're going in quiet. Taking them out as we find them. Trying not to set things off. But if we do, we move quick and hard. We settle this like we know how, okay? Okay by me. <gasps> With you, Morgan. All right, then. Through the trees here. Hey, we're real close. I'd leave... No, that doesn't suit me. Horse is the other side of this clearing. I'll get my guns off my horse, and I'm ready. Easy, Bill. Quiet. I'm just going to try and watch this. This is it. The cabin's just the other side of this hill. Okay. Off your horses. Let's go. You gonna get them knives? I said easy. Follow me, all right? It ain't far. We might have shared a horse, but we ain't friends. Remember, I'm watching you every moment. I ain't gonna shop you now, come on. It'd be suicide. You'll die, boy. But you'll lose your balls first. Jesus Christ. Just over the ridge. Okay, get down. Cabin's in the clearing down there. 
There'll be a bunch of fellers hiding out there, too. Are these fellas armed? Armed? Drunk? Wary of strangers, yep. And Cuomo O'Driscoll? Well, he'll be holed up in his cabin. Be passed out, booze blind, likely as not. And over there, someone's coming. So, uh, who's gonna tell him we ain't got nothing for the pot? Oh, let me think. The feller that spooked the game, I reckon. I'm gonna drain it. I I'll catch up. No, we ain't gonna fall for that. We're gonna wait so you can tell him yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If anyone's actually gonna shoot the messenger, it'd be that mean son of a bitch. Mm -hmm, yes, yeah, sir. Come on, shake it off. Shh. Come on. What are we doing about the pisser, Morgan? One by the tree. Okay. I'm gonna deal with this first fella. Okay, go to work. Wait on my mark. I'm gonna take a look at these boys. Sure thing. Right there. Check. You look out here. What you got, O'Driscoll? Karen, is that you? You all right? Sure. Thank you. He saved me. Come, O'Driscoll. He ain't here. You set us up. Come here! What? You set us up. No, I didn't. You did. Como Driscoll ain't here! He was here, I swear! I, sw I mean, if I was setting you up, I, I wouldn't have <laughs> saved your life. It's a good point, Arthur. All right, then, go on. Get out of here. Hey? I, I don't realize kill you. I can't set you up. Like oh, I'm shit. Oh, from American Dad. Letting you um, run away now. Go on! Get out of here! That's as good as killing me! Out there? Hey, Without boyfriend. you, Como just was gonna lose his mind about this. So? So I'm one of you now. 
Okay. Give me a break. All right, then. But I'm warning you. Oh, hey, I know. Come on, let's get to camp. So you got the cash, then? What cash? Yeah, there's usually some cash in the chimney. I'll check it. Rest of you boys, get to camp, quick. See, Arthur? Yeah, I ain't so bad. <laughs> hey, Bill. You tell Dutch old Karen ain't worth killing. Just yet. And they're right you are. At least you got something tucked away. Really? Hell. I did have 80% accuracy. I think I had. Fuck off. Shot. No, we are looted. Let's go. Yep. Another fun mission. Very fun. Very interesting. And the tin is for me, Karen, the whole group, really. subscribe and visit this on the next video. Goodbye!